A to Z liquidations was having a problem with mice, so they called STL FCO to help address the issue. We had a couple of cats that could not be returned to their location they had been trapped at, uh, and Al needed some mousers for his warehouse, so he provided a home for us to bring the kitty cats to. I had a significant problem at first, and then I got the, the cats down, and now I don't have a problem. A to Z liquidation CEO Al Thompson says mice were coming from the river and getting into his warehouse in St. Louis. Wanting to get rid of them, a mutual friend put him in contact with the St. Louis feral cat outreach. Normally we don't condone relocating the feral cats. They have a home, they came from a home, they're comfortable there, they typically have caretakers. In this particular case, this was a couple of cats that were turned into a, a pound in a uh, outstate Missouri. Zeman says the cats were pregnant when they came to the pound. They had their kittens who were adopted. STLFCO put the cats through the final process of what they call TNR, trap, neuter, and release. Now, at A to Z liquidations, they have a place to call home in the final phase of TNR, release. Everybody should do TNR. If you have feral cats in your community, reach out to us. We'll put you in touch with the tools that you need to make it happen and get TNR to take place and stop the overpopulation of feral cats. Thompson has already seen a difference from the dozens of mice that were invading his warehouse, and he doesn't mind the extra company. She brought the cats down. I'm glad to have them. Thanks to A to Z liquidations, the cats will be working animals with a safe place to stay. Reporting in St. Louis, Ty Hawkins, Fox 2 News.